For days now, all the women on my staff have been freaking out because this movie is coming out called Magic Mike XXL. I don't know much about the film, uh, just judging by the title. I'm assuming it's about a very heavy magician. I don't know. They said they were gonna go to a midnight showing. I said, I want a girls' night out, can I come with you? They said yes, and I rented a limo, and I think we're gonna have a good time. I wanna find out what this is all about. So let's get my Magic Mike XXL on. This is my assistant Sona's apartment. All the ladies are meeting there. This is like an episode of Cops. I mean, instead of arresting murderers, I'm just hanging out with some women and going and seeing a movie. Hey, Sona! Hi! How are you? What? Okay. That was my assistant showing no affection. How many years have I... You worked for me? Uh, a little over six no years No affection. Now. I did the... What's going on? You already did it, though, once. Okay. So we're good. All right. Okay. okay. Who's excited for a Magic Mike XXL tonight? <laughs> I haven't seen you ladies react this way to a movie franchise before. You didn't do this for Ninja Turtles. What's going on? <laughs> Tell the difference yeah. between a really good dancer mm -hmm. and thank you. Excuse me. Right, <laughs> right. You can tell the difference between a real between a real man and a guy who's just pretending to be a man who isn't a real man. Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> Channing Tatum is not. Great you don't think Channing Tatum? No. You know what this is called? The C Tatum. You know why? <laughs> this is what Channing Tatum drinks. I, I happen to know so. because I'm friends with CT. <laughs> Did you know that we're friends? No. With Che Tay Tay? Oh, don't That's, do that. That's, yeah, we're friends. Don't do that. Oh, Okay, Joe. Sona, this is your favorite, yes. Joe Manganiello. Manganiello. And I told you that I'm, I know him a bit. I've met him, he's been on the show. I don't think you, like, know him as well as you think you do. I, he's been on the show. He has been on the show, but that doesn't mean you, like, know him. I know him well enough to know that he doesn't look like this in real life. You like him a lot. Love. Would you love. marry him if you could marry him? I would marry him so hard and quickly. You don't marry someone hard. I, know, but I would marry him all night long. <laughs> I would marry him till he's sore. No, you don't marry, that's no, not. Don't, don't what, you said him. it. What is, what, is, what, is, what is this? What is he doing? He's like a bear. What is he? Like a, like, a, like a masculine Tarzan kind of guy. I don't know, I feel like the appeal to He looks like thing. a lumberjack that's off his meds. <laughs> he really does. He looked like he's pointing to a tree that he forgot to fell. <laughs> He's gone crazy. What do you think? What do you, what do you do? Does this guy do it for you? He does. You like this guy? What's different between this guy and me? I think he might have a little bit of a tan. <laughs> Are you excited about tonight? Uh, yeah. Are you going to scream and go, woo? What is it when women go, they go like, woo? Is that what you do? I might do a woo. If everyone else is doing a woo, you know. Well, we know someone who's going to be willing. Be Sona woos when, uh, you know, lunch shows up. She's like, woo! <laughs> Raise your hand tonight if you would like it if you saw a penis. Be honest. Be, be honest. Would you like to see one? I'd be fine with it. You'd be yeah. interested? What do you mean it would be interesting? What are you, a scientist? <laughs> I'm a dermatologist by trade. I only wish to see the shaft. To check for various lesions. What do you mean it would be interesting? Okay, but let me ask I'm you something. I'm sure this one's enormous. Okay, let me tell you something. Again, this is a fallacy. I hate to break it to you. Oh. It is a scientific fact that men with this upper body have a very small... I thought it was supposed to be for like every pound you lose, you, get an you gain an inch. What are you talking about? Are you saying, are you saying Jared from Subway has a 36 inch... lose 600 pounds who are trapped in their home are walking around with a freaking fire hose between their legs? No! These are the fallacies! What kind of dance moves are we going to see? Can anyone show me what... Who here is a good dancer? Who could show me basically what we're going to see tonight? I take their uh, pelvic region and then they just pound it to the ground. <laughs> up and down. What's the point of that? It's uh, simulating uh, uh, sex, intercourse. sexual intercourse. With the floor? Okay, I'm gonna play some music and I'm gonna do what feels natural. My venue is equal to anything you're gonna hear or see tonight.
Is this good? Not bad. Not bad. How about this? Look at this. <laughs> How about this? Oh my God. Oh my God. Is it a oh it, it hurts! Oh okay, now. Oh. oh my God. I've told the editors that if to leave my body exposed. If I'm hexled out right now, that would be the, because they thought it didn't look good. How do you ladies like the limo, huh? Yeah. Nice, and look what I brought, champagne. Woo! Go! Woo! Ah! Let's, go! <laughs> Let's talk about the myth of penis and size. Now, I have it on good authority that women don't care for a large penis. It can be bothersome. We hear the air conditioning. We are at Big Wang. We are having an incredible feast. What would you ladies like? We have fun shots called booty juice. Whatever you want. Dog Wait, what's booty? Yeah, what's booty juice? You gotta taste it. What is your name? Leah. Leah, very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. We're gonna go see Magic I Mike know I'm XXL. Are you jealous? Yeah. You know, I really want to buy you a booty juice. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. That's the second time this week I've said that. Yeah. <laughs> First time to a woman. All right. We're good. Can you come with us tonight? Maybe I have to call my boss. Yes, don't you? Well, no, no, no. What if, what if your boss says yes? Can you come with us? If my boss says yes, I'll go. With yes. I would like eight tickets for Magic Mike XXL. Woo! Okay, that is seven female tickets and one man ticket. Yeah! No one wooed on that. Magic Mike! child just is being taken away quickly because you saw a man have sex with the floor. This is getting really exciting now. We are eight minutes away from Magic Mike XXL starting, and I am ready. I am lubricated. I am ovulating. I, I, I am more woman than I've ever been before, and I'm ready to be taken on the ride of my life. I'm ready to have a baby. A baby with a movie. So. I'm tired. It's been a long day. I'm just gonna turn in. Oh. <laughs> good night, Jen. Good night, Jen. Man, you were really good in the movie. You were really good, too. I wasn't in the movie, Joe. Joe? No sex tonight. And thanks to Joe Manganiello for getting into bed with me. Uh...